What's up guys, Kelly Dita here. Today we are back in Creatures of Scenario to check out two new creatures, but one of them is a secret, so we'll get to that one in a second. This one is not. This is going to be in the uh, Creature Missions section when you select the Missions button on the menu, and you're going to have to complete the four tasks that you see there in order to unlock this particular creature right here. And this is going to be the Kavangal. It's a Tier 4 Terrestrial Carnivore. And as you can see, we got the walking animation right here, which is pretty smooth. And look at this, guys. It's been dubbed the banana creature. <laughs> And you can see why, because it's got this banana looking sweater. I'm not going to lie, it looks really comfortable. And it was just raining earlier, so it was kind of perfect. But it's got some cool features. Look at the big fat tail on the back. You got these huge thick front legs with these thick paws and claws. But look at the back, guys. Definitely skipping leg day back here, that's for sure. Okay, so we got the running animation right there. We showed you guys the walking animation. Let's go ahead and show you guys the broadcast call. This thing has some really cool calls. So this is going to be your friendly call. And here's your aggro. And your voice. Nice. Okay, so this creature doesn't have a Q ability on PC and it also doesn't have a breath. So I got nothing there. All right, so now let's show you guys the aggro animation right here. Sweet. And then we got the cower animation. There we go. Don't look at me. And then we got the hide scent animation or mud animation, there we go. All right, so now let's go ahead and show you guys the stats and abilities. So for this Cavangal creature, we're gonna have a health of 6,750. It's gonna do 180 damage. It's got a speed of 24 walk with 58 run. It's gonna weigh almost 10,000 pounds, 9,750. It's gonna take 50 minutes to grow and it's a tier four, like I said. For its abilities, we have a 1.5 poison per bite. It's got 100% bleed defense and we got the iron stomach ability, which is pretty cool, guys. So for those of you that don't know, that is going to give you the ability to eat rotten meat around the map. You're still going to take some of your thirst and your health away, but you're not going to get the sickness ailment, which is a huge, huge plus because sometimes there's a lot of that on the map and you can't find some fresh meat. So that's definitely a good ability to have. Guys, that is the new mission creature, the Cavangal, aka the Banana. Uh, so now let's go ahead and switch over to the secret creature. All right, and here we go, guys. This is the new secret mission creature, which if I'm being honest, I don't even know how to obtain it yet, but I went ahead and purchased a stored version for the video, and this is the Ali Kuda. It got some inspiration from uh, the Barracuda, which is pretty sick. Check out the cool looking tail. Almost looks like a shark tail back there. It's got these really cool highlighted tips on the fins, which is sick. I love the color palette. Look at the skinny little head. What's up, little guy? So it's pretty sweet, and let's go and show you guys the animations. This is gonna be a tier four carnivore. So this is gonna be your regular swimming speed right here. And then we got the shift swimming speed right there, which is pretty sweet. Now check out your stamina bar, guys. It is gonna go down pretty quickly, so keep that in mind. Don't worry, because all you have to do is cower. And if you also look back, it's gonna regen even faster, which is pretty sweet. And there's your cower animation, by the way. But my favorite by far is the aggro animation. Check this out, guys. Look at this, it's like whiplash. One of the sickest animations though, for sure. Okay, so now let's go ahead and show you guys the broadcast call right here. And then we got the friendly call. And here is your aggro. And your voice. All right, so now let's go ahead and check out the sitting animation, which if you notice, it just straightens everything out perfectly flat look at that tail moves a little bit which is kind of cool and then we got your laying animation which throws a nice little v with the head down that is definitely looking like it's asleep guys that's for sure all right now for stats and abilities for the alakuda creature we're gonna have a health of 3800 it's gonna do 425 damage dang that's huge that's big time for sure it's gonna have a speed of 40 walk with 93 run it's gonna weigh 7,000 pounds. It's got bleed resistance of 20% and it's got a two out of three night vision. Now for its abilities, you're gonna have three bleed per bite. You got the sand breath and you got the strength in numbers ability, which is pretty sick. Check out the sand breath right here, guys. This is pretty cool. It's an elemental breath that's gonna inflict 0.25 damage per second and it's gonna give your targets blurred and tunnel vision, which is pretty nice, especially since you don't have that much uh, stamina and you're trying to run away. That can be huge so you can blur them up and then you can go ahead and bite them with your forward 25 damage. All right, well, there you go, guys. That's gonna be the two new creatures in this week's update. Oh, we gotta get the Megalodon one bite. One bite, I'm calling it right here. Watch this, watch this, one bite. Oh, let's go. All right, guys, we'll see you on the next one. Peace.